Welcome back from a field of almost 100 ladies. The Dream Entertainment team narrowed their search for the ultimate dream girls who will represent the brand at this year's Dream Weekend in the grill, July 28 to August 1. Today we unveil the lucky and lovely ladies who have made the final cut. But first, Dream Entertainment Director Ron Burke on our stage right now. Ron! Bless it, sir. Oh, Good yeah, to have you. Always a pleasure. All right, ladies, welcome. Welcome, ladies. Hi. All right, cool. So, sir, jump in and tell me the mechanics of this search. How did you go about searching, okay. finding these la ladies? Well, we, we, we actually did the Dream Girl search, I'd say, maybe over the last two years. Mm. And we've been pressured, pressured by the media, in a sense, but pressured by the general populace um, to have this search. Because a lot of persons want to come and experience Dream, mm. not only from a promotional standpoint, but from an internal standpoint. Okay. Right? And these are ambassadors. They, they're going to be involved in customer service. They're going to be involved in our VIP. There are so many events that are happening between now and when we get to Abaddon Special Dream Weekend that none of us as directors are going to be able to go to all. So okay. we need ambassadors. And what better way to have than fabulous ambassadors. So Okay, so they will have to know everything about Dream Weekend. Then. <laughs> yeah, and where to go and how to go and how mm. to behave and those things. I right. suppose if... Um, patrons ask these questions, these ladies will, will have to answer them? Indeed. Um, they're going to be briefed accordingly. Mm -hmm. so, so between now and when we get to the 28th of July, when we actually start, mm -hmm. um, they'll know everything in terms of the lineup, in terms of costing, in terms of you know, what to tell not only Jamaica, but the world. Dream is, Dream is so global. So they'll be identifiable, right? Not that wearing anything, any brand no, or no. anything, but they'll be identifiable for people to they'll, walk up to them? They'll be branded accordingly. Um, okay. Outfits are being made, you know, a special big up to Romy. She's the one that's we're putting the outfits together for the team. Mm -hmm. um, so you know, I'd say maybe another week, you know, as they roll out, you'll see them out in the streets, out in the events, representing us mm -hmm. to the fullest. Okay, so they're not just eye candies? No, they're ambassadors. No, the don't week. call them no eye candies. No. <laughs> the dream girls are our ambassadors. Okay, cool. All right, so what can you tell us about? We're going we're gonna to have you meet the ladies in just a little bit, all of them, right here on stage. are going to do stuff for us that will show you what they've got, <laughs> even though they are not, they are not eye candies. But, but first, um, mm. t t talk to us a little bit about the package. What's in it? For Dream this year? Mm. Oh, well, oh, what you can tell us at this time, because at you, this, you, right. have, oh, you right. have some time to go. All right, we do. Mm. Um, it's, it's five days. It starts on the 28th of July and ends on the 1st of August, which is Emancipation Day. Mm. And on the first day, we're going to be having our Dream Live concert. Dream Live is going to be led by Magnum, the brand. So okay. it's, it's, it's dubbed Magnum Dream Live concert. You know, mm. they were they're on board for last year again. And we so far, we have Bounty Killer. We have Popcorn. Mm. We have Spice. We have Massacre. Wow. and more to come. Heavyweights? Yeah, for us, how we look at it is, a lot of persons come to Jamaica. We have the Jamaicans here who want to see the show, but we have a lot of persons who come to Jamaica, and they want to see a lot of the artists. Truth be told, a lot of them can't travel. Mm -hmm. And we want to showcase them. They're out there on the internet, the digital space, they're out there on YouTube, but a lot of them are not able to go into these markets. And two of our biggest markets, in particular the US and Canada, now get the opportunity to come and see them live and there, interact with them, watch them perform, pics, you know, autographs, whatever. They're there, live and direct for the weekend on the 28th. Locals match up with foreigners who's leading in terms of patronage. It varies, but I, I'd put it at a 50-50. 50-50? I'd put it at a 50-50. So it half of who we will see in Negril right. are from are residing overseas and not necessarily Jamaicans or Caribbeans. No. We have, we have dreamers from all over the world. Mm -hmm. um, there is no country you can possibly in, in terms of a name that you can call, know that we don't have at least a one dreamer from that country coming over. Okay. The numbers are phenomenal. You know, and how we know, our website, when they come and purchase from the, from the website, it tells you which bank issued the card and their address. Okay. And that gives us insight into the data. So we've been capturing that for a number of years. We have direct contact with them and every year, Amsterdam, the Netherlands, I mean, you name it, China, wherever. The dream is a global dream. And we want Jamaica and the world to recognize that we have a brand that speaks not only to Jamaica, but Jamaica and Jamaican culture, or food, or music, and everything Jamaica has to offer. It's an event tourism destination every year, and it's just the beginning. Speak a little bit mm -hmm. about the, the, the impact economically right. on the, the local um, Negril right. economy. Mm -hmm. How do people 
get something from the vendors and so on. Okay. What kind of impact are we, are we talking about? In terms about, of right. dollar, Roughly, dollar I'd figures. say about two years ago, and this was mm -hmm. two years ago, and since then we have grown maybe 15 to 25 percent since then. Uh, they did a survey on, on Dream, and Appleton Special Dream Weekend by default. Um, and conservatively, we contributed during that, just that, those five days, 1.5 billion to the Jamaican economy. That was not an article written by us. It had nothing to do with us. As a matter of fact, it catch us off guard when we saw it in the paper. Mm. That was written and published financially. It said that the average visitor to Dream will spend at minimum, at minimum, at least 200 US dollars. And most times that's maybe on a per day basis. And, and we have and thousands it's, it's, coming in. And that money is spreading around. Spreading around. So Locals in the grid. All the restaurants, the, 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 you know, the salons, the barbershops, the hotels, everybody, we don't, the peanut man, the chicken man on the street, everybody benefits from Dream. And that's why we think it's so important for Jamaica, you know, corporate Jamaica, you know, the, 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 the Jamaica Tourist Board is on board, and so many other sponsors, NCB, just to name a few, mm -hmm. need to come on board and support an initiative that speaks the language. It's about Jamaica, it's about Jamaicans, and everyone benefits right down to the government, from landing fees, the TEF, you name it, we're contributing. And you are the biggest party weekend in the Caribbean, In the it? Caribbean, yes, sir. You boast that. Is that true? Well, well I, I, I'd love for you to find something comparable as a party weekend. <laughs> oh, really? Bigger than I, mean, I, said, I, I tried. I, right. be honest, I, I'll be honest. I tried. I can't find it. So Good. I, I give it to you until... So, so I know otherwise. So we have but, the crown until then. No, I, I have a reason. Um, I mean, on stage, as you know, we're, we're a partner here. Yes. And we're in it because we believe in it. Cool. We want to be, to help you to tell the story. We want you to, we want to help you to stimulate the world to come to Jamaica. And we appreciate it. And that. that's why we're lending our platform to it. And so, well, we do, sir. And we're, we're happy to be back this year. And we will be all over the grill. Indeed. Capturing the dream Lovely ladies. ladies. And that's, and speaking of which, Iran, we're going to get rid of you and that's me. Fine. That's fine. I want to give the ladies the, the stage right now to show us what they've got. You're my dream. Baby, I'm your dream girl. Hi, thanks for watching our video. Hope you have enjoyed it. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking right here. And enjoy so much more where that came from. Dream girl